Hello people, how you doing? December the 19th, 2021, a Sunday. Well, it's going, uh, let's see, 42 degrees right here in or California. It's going to warm up to, I believe, around 62 degrees today. And it's sunny. Well, as um, a lot of you people know, I went to the VA for my hernia problem. Still waiting for a phone call. You know, uh, <laughs> uh, you see my video, I was pretty upset. My blood pressure was sky high and everything else. I fight all that traffic and everything else in Phoenix, Arizona. But anyway, you know, 22 a day. Does that sound familiar to you? Well, but don't, let me inform you. 22 veterans a day. You can Google this. Or committing suicide each and every day. Veterans. Let me repeat that. 22 veterans a day are committing suicide. Taking their own life in this country. And they have been since Vietnam. More veterans have committed suicide, taking their own life, than have died in all the wars since Vietnam and including Vietnam. Why is that? Well, about two weeks ago, I started calling the VA for supplies and my hand controls for Miss Anger. Have her a thing. You know what I mean? If a person's out there may have a little mental problems because they went to Vietnam, PTSD, and, and you know, the list goes on and on. I had all that stuff. Don't take much for us, uh, you know, the people with uh, those problems to, you know, be set off. Well, you know, when you're like depressed, you need help. Well, you know, they say call 9-1 if it's an emergency. <clears throat> or the National Crisis Suicide Prevention Number, or whatever it is. So I guess they're crying. But, you know, it's a real shame in America that the American veterans go to war, put their life on, down on the line for this country, or treat like shit. I know there's some veterans out there that go to the VA hospital on a regular basis. You know, it took me a little while to get into the system, but once I was in, it's a lot easier to get a referral to get more and more drugs from the VA. 326 pounds, migraines, seizures, chronic asthma, high blood pressure, two heart attacks, PTSD, suicidal, alcoholism, this went on and on and on. Why? All the poison the VA was giving me to help me. So what did I do? Tapered off all those pills that the VA was giving me. Little by little, you know, you got to do that. You can't just stop, man. You go, ooh. But anyway, it's rough. But two and a half years, I put myself on a diet and exercise program, a light exercise program. I was in an electric wheelchair. The only exercise I was getting was going forward, back, left, right, whatever. Two and a half years, I lost 160 pounds. That's a whole nother chuck. Where'd he go? Well, I hope he, you know, left the universe. 195 pounds. I try to, you know, I eat, but a lot of people don't know this. A lot of times, breakfast is my meal. I have my Skippy peanut butter. Crunchy. <laughs> Super crunch. Anyway, just have it there. If I feel a little hungry in the afternoon or in the evening, I just take a, you know, a tablespoon. You know, it sort of satisfies the hunger. That's what I do. 
Each and every morning I start my day with meditation for about anywhere between 30 and minutes and an hour. Relieve my pain, stress, thoughts, clear my mind. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it really, really helps me relieve my pain. Then I usually do about an hour of uh, upper body exercise. About a half hour of lower exercise. It's just me. 195 pounds, I think I'm pretty fit. So, what I'm going to do today? Well, I don't know. You know, it depends on my hernia. Yesterday is a pretty good day. I mean, it uh, really wasn't bothering me too much. But I wasn't really doing too much either. And so today I probably won't do too much. And it might not hurt me again today. That's going to be my schedule, people. But remember, <clears throat> sadly, it's an epidemic out there. It's been going on since Vietnam. And nobody's doing anything about it. Not really. They're not stopping those 22 veterans a day that are committing suicide. Why is a country, <laughs> you know, America, why is that happening? Well, because the government, the politicians, the people just don't care. I'm sorry. <clears throat> um, I'm going to get off here before I get too emotional. <clears throat> but yeah, remember, 22 brave American veterans have to commit suicide each and every day because they're not getting the help that they not only promised, but what they earned. Enjoy your freedom. It sure the hell isn't free, baby.